They'll be calling you a radical, Kevin Blanche and San Simeon. Now, it's important that you don't have to crawl all the way out in to get a look at starfish and tide pools. These columns on the bottoms of these historic pillars are really the canary because you can see a red, crimson, a purple, an orange starfish, which this, these columns are infamous for them. You could spot them a mile away. There's none, there's zero. Now, we're gonna talk about why and how recording history of the controlling the media. So, there was a little baby, a young pup, still right here. We haven't seen many that, you know, this whole area is famous for their seal. I did just a minute ago, saw Muir. The first Muir I've seen in a long, a long time. They all washed up star for that three years ago right now. Playing volleyball, is that him? Right there. I don't know, what's it? yeah. Yeah, there he goes, there he goes, there he goes. That's him, ain't it? Nope. Back. He's right here, fish. So we've talked to dozens and dozens and dozens of fishermen this trip, up and down, whatever. I mean, dozens. We've talked to two fish have been caught. A guy caught a one right over there, and a perch. No anchovies, no sardines, and this is one of the really great places to fish. It always has been up there fishing. Now, one, I mean, you always caught stuff here. It's hard to get to. There's the mirror. Okay, he's way out there. See, I don't know if you can see him, but that's him. The only one. Usually they're in pairs, right? <laughs> the male or the female's dead. You know, there's one. He's busy trying to find something to eat. Right? So, anyway, the columns, you can see how bare they are. There should be reds and pinks and blues and crimsons. Now, I gotta apologize to Sue. I met a fantastic environmentalist, her and her daughter digging through the pools. She showed me the picture of that little, she did find a little red crimson under the cow pollock here. But she digs, I mean, this woman works. They found a little purple, I saw a picture, a little small guy, real sickly little, orange, bat fit star, real sickly little guy, and a little teeny crimson. I says, oh my God, that's a rare one. I haven't seen one. Here he comes, here he comes. Maybe. Oh, there is a pair. See, there's the other one right there. So there is a pair. See him floating out there? There's the mate. Flying to him. It's that time of year. They dance backwards on the sand. They starve death. You know, I'll talk about Toshiba. There they are. The other two up on the thing, I think it's a seagull, but maybe it's a comorat. That might be a comorat, so maybe it isn't a pair. That might be a comorat. My eyes ain't so good, and that's a long ways away. But I did see right here, it was real close. One of the mirrors was right here. So there, there you go, there you go, see him? See him swimming towards the rock? Eee! There he is, here he is, see him? He just popped up. They'll talk back to you. They'll talk back to you. So anyway. He said he's busy trying to find some food. There he is, there he is. Here he comes. Thinking, who's this? Uh, 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 here he comes, here he comes. 
beautiful. Oh, what a beauty he is. <coughs> All right. Come to visit. They always do. You just got to talk to them. And you just say hi and you would move away. But they always come talk. They're very communal. They, they usually travel in families. The seals are really, they're really family oriented. They travel with mom, dad, siblings, cousins. They really travel in families. They're very communal, amazing. Let's walk up. Nothing on the column. I want to show you guys something. So, this is a really grand spot in the world. William, he got it. Randolph Hearst. And that way, the castle's right there. So, that was cool, he came up. So, this should be a long video, okay? There's no life up in the creek. I went all the way through it. It looks like a crystal blue lake. So, here's the old staircase that used to be here. That's another thing I could write a whole book on, just the things I find, because county municipalities used to just dump. I mean, I find beautiful concrete columns and whatever. They just dumped them on the edge. That's what they did for decades and decades. I could show you really historic stuff that's just laying in the sand. If it was anything ballast, concrete, that's what they did with it. So, there used to be this incredible sign that used to sit right here. Really great set here. They have a little bit of it left. Now, wait till you see this. You're going to love this sign. It was an old wood one that set right here. It was hand painted. They just recently cut it out. See the four columns on the bottom where the bench is? That's where it's cut down. But here, this is the one they replaced it with, which has been here for a while. Okay. Respect them, look at them, don't touch them. This was all here all over. Lots and lots of starfish, lots of sea anemones. Shield limpets, hermit crabs, of course. These were loaded. You know, we see teeny, teeny bit of life, so. It used to be an old wood one that was hand painted. It was the same thing, but it was a big one. There's the old columns to it, so. Eucalyptus are not native in uh, California. Captain Cook bought there. Neither are tamaracks. Neither are a lot of the coastal community. But the big California live oaks are. And, you know, a lot of people are. And this bullshit is inevitable. We're just going to kill the sea. Indigenous people lived here for millions of years. At least thousands and thousands of years. Many thousands of years. So, William Randolph Hearst. You want to control the entire narrative? Because Rosebud, Citizen Kane on Balco, so, the Hearst Castle is right there. You see it? Control the media. You have to control the media. You control the media, we'll be able to turn this into a mark and rape and loot. I talked to Patty Hearst in the grocery store three years ago. Because Jules was with me. She said, that's Patty Hearst right there. Because there, nobody lives here. This is a little teeny, teeny thing. She look how little She's very nice. Oh, hi. It's amazing. So, he controlled the media. You know, Joseph Grubel? Who taught him? It's like, Walsh Stegner. You think the Germans invented genocide, you know nothing about the American West. We taught them. Well, my enough Hearst taught Grubel to the German thing. They taught, it was learned right here. So this is the sea life now. Here's our sea life. So this is what we're gonna do from now on. We'll go to the aquarium. We'll look at pretty pictures. Yeah, we'll go to the sea glass. Where'd you sleep last night, Kev? Where'd you sleep last night? I slept in that dead fucking time. Where the sun from Fukushima always fucking shines. It's the ecology, stupid. It's your pseudo facto theology. It's your biology. It's the ecology. Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Annie, are you okay? Annie, are you okay? Annie, are you okay? You've been hit by. was, was, and don't blame it on humans, 
Blame it on us Urals coming across. Us Urals. 168 years all it took. When indigenous humans lived here for thousands of years. Control the information. Control. Then you can build your castle above the marine layer. Oh yeah, you don't gotta worry about that now because there is no marine layer. 100 million dead trees right through here. They cut them down as fast as fire hazard. The elephant seals are right there. There's a bunch of dead ones. We shot that footage too. So, Joseph Google's on Balco. Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Annie, are you okay? What was her, the name of Patty Hearst's uh, group, the surfers, when they were robbing the banks? What are they called? L-O, the... P-L-O, on Balco. Stay in tune at P-L-O. I'm about